All right, good afternoon, everybody. It is September 16th on a Wednesday. But anyways, let's go see what's going on. And these guys are busy in the rain, actually. Working on tiling. A little feature column has been getting done. Lots of little things going on today. And big things. We got painting of our wonderful bars and more tiling of the stone and then the electrician busy busy uh, all right so we still have more primering going on in here and some sanding going on in here takes a long time doing these wood and they still actually have one more piece to do they need to put in a sliver right here where my hand is going all the way across so it's more flush because we're going to put lighting up underneath there but i still told them yesterday about it so i don't think they've forgotten we'll see when they get done though and our cabinet so you can see how this is this layout is going to be we have little bins on the bottom and then we have a dish drawer on the second one and these cabinets are just going to be a, a straight across the bottom opened up for the two two bins and then we'll have uh, drawers for silverware and utensils and stuff. We'll see how all that goes. Looks like he has everything already cut for the next section so I'm curious to see uh, the rest of this get put together. A little bit long though these pieces are that he has cut because they're just going to be little tiny pieces that he puts in. Our stove is going to take up quite a bit of room. And then our big old monster refrigerator. Actually, he has it laid out. So our stove is going to go right in here. So that's the power outlet for the stove, I think. But it's not the right connection for the stove. So he's going to have to change that outlet. And we don't need a single outlet there. I don't know if Christian working on that or whatnot. Anyways, that's what it is. And then you can see the drawings right here. That's going to be another little countertop piece. And then you see the other little thing right here, the 16 centimeter. That is going to be an entire spice rack all the way up the wall. So we have lots of spices. We use lots of different stuff. Uh, different cooking. From here over to almost the light switch right there is our refrigerator area. So. Our kitchen area is actually going to be a little bit small for space-wise. Um, it's still part of the, the triangle they tell you that you need to have for the kitchen area. Uh, most of our lowers are here and then our uppers are going to be over here. But we also have our center island whenever that happens. That's actually a seven foot long center island right there. Look at that first hand. Getting to see. Our wonderful LED lights, our cove lighting. Yes, it's a it's a warm light and it's not daylight. We did all the pin lights daylight and then we did our cove lighting warm lighting. So a little bit of di different uh, effect, different type of lighting in here. These are our actual lights, our, they call them pin lights. These little, I don't know, I, to me they're like dome lights, can lights, but a little bit short LED. They're 12 watts, so they are bright. That's one thing I noticed, they are absolutely bright, these lights are. I was actually surprised they used 12 watts and not like a seven or something because we got lights everywhere and they are bright. I checked it out last night. These guys had the house lights on. Woo, it was bright in here. So, there's a little bit of issues right now. The electrician's trying to figure out what's going on, the wiring. Fortunately, he's gonna have to cut a hole up here because some of the wiring wasn't done right from our previous electrician. It's been all enclosed since him and now he's got all the headaches that was left. We got a little bit of electrical issue from before. So we'll just patch it up and call it good, but it sucks that they have to do extra work from someone before them. Now, uh, let the fun begin. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see it, but I sure can. Uh, the white contrast between the two things are just wonderful, but he's using a razor blade, exacto knife, 
that cut out the ceiling so they have a nice hole they can work in since the electrical for our lighting they can find the electrical up there such a shame it was a beautiful solid piece not anymore oh there it comes and there's all the lighting stuff that they are looking for so i am looking at the information for our LED lighting for our cove lighting. So I guess this is the brand. It's all in Chinese. So let's take a look exactly what this big old roll is. All right. So I guess this is the this is the LED. So pretty basic on a big roll, and then it comes with these little connectors. I guess it comes with two connectors per roll or something. That's how they connect them. So. They hardwire it in, so the plug-in that they have there, and they just cut it off and then wire it in. I do know, I've heard that the little, that little box, that little hard plastic piece, so this little thing right here, I think it's a fuse, but once it goes out, you gotta replace the whole system, I, from my understanding. And this thing's really easy. It really just connects. They cut off where it needs to be in the little section, and then they plug it into this. There's the fun right there that was done for him. That was left behind. Can't find out where the wire, which wire is for he, his LED. You can't get it. Let's get something working right over here. Not sure exactly what's going on for this part of the fun. I do see up there in a the corner there's a white wire, which I would suspect that's the plug-in, the hard wire piece for the LEDs. Our whole entire crew is working downstairs today. So it's uh, interesting. It's pretty packed down here in the bottom of the house. Our uh, cabinet guy is busy doing cabinets, trying to get this set in. All right, I guess that's the way to hold a board right there. Oh, I need to be careful. You about lost some toes. <laughs> They're about to chip out this wall because we're putting a light switch in here for the outside light. We're doing a little bit of change. We were actually gonna run everything together, but instead they're gonna put a switch with the power running outside. All right, it is afternoon, and we are checking everything. And do you guys see that? Lights on the outside are on now. So we're getting closer and closer. These ones here need to be next. I don't know. He's doing one section at a time, so he's just cruising right along. And look at this too. So there's been lots of Lots and lots of tiling stuff going on. Look at that, yes. He's almost got this section done. Then he gets to go upstairs and do more. But they're killing these blocks pretty quick. I see it out, but we didn't get a chance to see it in action. This is the paster type thing. I don't know, it sticks the edges of the molding of the cabinets together. And we are in the process of pulling out one of the CCTV lines. It actually was supposed to been over here, but we forgot to cover the front door with all of our wonderful CCTVs. So now it's going to be here and it's just going to shoot this way. Uh, we got a lot of cameras for our little little area. But uh, yeah, we didn't get the door. But we can always solve it. We can order something from the United States called the ring. And that'll solve our problem. All right, and they got their wiring issues fixed from up there. So now we have our cove lighting. And you can see over here in the corner, we have our internet. We're actually just gonna be a mesh system that we're putting in the house. And that is gonna hardwire in one of the little boxes that we have for our wire mesh system for the entire house. And, wow, it's a, it's a busy day. Everything was done down here today. Uh, the electrician got this done. This is gonna be a little outlet right up here. And it runs right through and underneath our wonderful window. That's for our outdoor lighting. Happened to have forgot about it. It didn't get put in, now it's put in. So, this is what they put in right here. This is the little section they did all that breaking up of everything and put all this in. All right, and the cabinetry stuff is going on. He is having a good time. I'm giving him a hard time because I don't see any changes, but he made a bunch of stuff. On these little poles right here, he uh, actually used the stripping 
for the edges and melted it with that little fancy machine. I couldn't remember what it was called earlier, but that's what he does is puts it on here so you can't tell what they got going on. All right, so we got the shelvings going on. Looks like they uh, pretty much have completed the shelvings. Maybe we can move on to something else. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe it's been painting the house. Not sure exactly, but we'll find out. Oh yeah, I also forgot to say, look at these lights. I know they were on yesterday, but uh, he's got them going. Everybody's happy, I think, with the lighting situation. It was getting really dark in here, getting with the windows and the wonderful weather we're having right now. But uh, anyway, light. We got lights downstairs. They're still working on some of the stuff upstairs. That's another deal for tomorrow. Alright, so I gotta say something. This place looks like a dump ground. This is right outside our wonderful door. Next to theirs. It's, I don't know what the heck is going on. One of these days, someone will clean this up. If I say enough, like, every day for the next couple of weeks, it might get cleaned up before they leave. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, they got some work to do. <laughs> Looking at something, I'm seeing he's using to put all these cabinets together with some builders. Bonds material. It's like liquid nails, I would suspect. Something close to it. Good morning, everybody. Today is Thursday, the 17th. Part two of this wonderful video. And it's looking like the second coat of this. And our tiles, well, there is no more tiles, I think, right now. All right, and some changes are coming to our front porch because they put a step here without figuring out the depth of the dirt. It's gonna be a lot higher than where they put the step. So we're gonna pour another set so it's level, and then, from my understanding, it's gonna go all the way out up to the gate, and then we're gonna have our step down. So right when you open the gate, the step down on the outside of the uh, property, or, I mean the fence, that is. So it's a little bit weird. I'm not sure how it's going to work, but they're gonna try to do to solve some problems we got here at the front porch. I mean, it would have been nice for these steps, but we have too many little issues, like over here, the dirt is almost about probably eight to ten inches so almost leveled with the step with the main landing right here all right and our cabinets tree stuff is moving right along we do have one issue for some weird reason our measurements were off and we put the electrical outlet right dead smack in the middle of our spice cabinet so they need to move it over a few inches <laughs> about six inches because i would suspect maybe my coffee maker will go right there it's a good little area but i guess it's right next to the stove so we'll see what goes there but anyway and that's what's going on in this little section and we still have stuff going on the doors the doors lots of door stuff I take a lot of work too, all this wood does. Can't wait for them to be done with the door. I know he'll be spending lots and lots of time doing these doors. This little section right here, we're waiting for the glass to insert on that. There's a few other places going on that uh, need to be replaced. We have a really scratched up window that needs to be replaced. And then we also have kitchen one. We're going to change it out and do the slider instead of a push out. Yes, I think we're paying for that one. So I still want to put a slider. So that's what we're getting in the, over there. That window right there is going to be a slider. And these are the two middle windows are supposed to be push out. So they're reworking this whole setup here. We actually don't even know why they ended up being solid in the middle because we actually bought actuators to push these windows open because if they're so high. And that's another just waiting game for that to be done, right? And we have cleanup time. So I'm wondering if some tiling's gonna happen in this room. Do I want to have tiling going on here? Not really because the painting isn't done. We don't have cabinetry done. This whole wall isn't done. This isn't done. So I am not sure exactly what the process is because I know our beautiful, really nice white tiles are probably going to get trashed out. I guess we have finished products. 
Kindly do not touch. Wow. Paint, paint, paint. Well, they must be still wet. Interesting look to them. So, amongst the other fun things we got going on, we ran out of our stones. So we got a little bit, probably two feet up here to do. And over here, there's a whole lot that needs to be done. I, I can't remember when I opened it, if I got this, but uh, now I'm getting it. But uh, we got a lot of stone tiles that we need. So I guess the dirt back there now is going to be less than what it shows right now so that means then they're gonna have to dig this tire edge around the whole house yeah i didn't realize that's what they were gonna do so that's what's gonna happen now so they still gotta take the plastering down further and do some more digging i should take them a, a little while a week or so to get that done and now what uh the bosses came in and said i sell i should say we are going to fill all of this in with one big old cement slab now our wonderful mason is gonna set everything up and fill this little area in and then we're just going straight across right here right in front of the gate and we're gonna have a nice little seven inch i am being told seven inch step up right when you come through that gate when you open it you're walking straight in you're you're stepping up yes sir you are stepping up but it's all right that's how we're gonna do it all right and it is afternoon i don't know what's happened but something different is going on but he filled this in the one step down but we have this we're not sure i thought he was gonna take it out and close everything off but instead we're just gonna leave a step down and i still trying to figure out what's going on me it's what it is all right and we still have more spackling going on so these guys are still going around doing this primering around everything windows sanding got more of our cabinetry going up and look at this little insert yeah there's our little uh spice rack over the top and then our little cabinet over the top or refrigerator well this area our little storage area pantry type deal is I guess dry at some point and I'll come back through and primer in it I guess since they they put the spackling on it all right it's like more primary serious concentration going on up here all right and we got standing going on and looking like he is putting the ceiling working on them and getting them ready they actually told us like over a month ago they were gonna do the ceiling but it just didn't get done and they got moved on to something else all right everybody that's about it for our wonderful video i hope y'all enjoyed it give it a thumbs up if you did don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed and don't forget to hit the bell button down there in that corner to get notified on our next video. Thank you again, and goodbye.